the world we know was not always thus. In the time before, when the maps of today were not yet drawn, we bordered upon lands bright and strange, lands filled with peoples and creatures, the likes of which no one now can imagine. Jinn were created, before humans, from scorching fire. Sometimes they came as friends and neighbors. Other times, well, you know how neighbors can be. One place in particular was closer to the knife edge than any other. Sheba, oldest and greatest of the Arabian kingdoms. This was the age of Queen Bilquis, David, and Suleiman the Wise, an age where anything was possible. And for a young man called Inar, it was the beginning of all his trouble. What in the world? I should probably be running away, but the village could be in danger. I have to find out what's going on. You can run all you want, witch! It will do you no good! No matter where you go, no matter how well you try to hide, I will hunt you down. I will find you. I'll find you! <laughs> Merciful Allah! Are you alright? Quiet, please. He must not find me. Who is he? Um, who are you? He is Marit, a powerful jinn who thirsts for my life. I am called... You're a jinn, aren't you? Yes, and I am dying. M maybe I can make you some bandages or something. Or I can get our doctor from the village. It's too late for that. What is your name, boy? Me? Uh, Enar. Then forgive me, Enar. Forgive you? Forgive you for what? For what I am about to do. Wait! <clears throat> what are you doing? What I needed to do to survive. What have you done to me? We are melded together. Two minds sharing one body. No, get out of me! Be quiet! If Marit finds us, we're both dead. You can't control me! Yes, I can. I'm running out of patience, witch! Show yourself, or I'll burn this whole blasted valley to the ground! No. You killed everyone. My family. I'm sorry. There has to be another way around this thing. Here, let me... How did 
you do that? In my own body, I could... Come on out, Mira. Look at what you've done to these poor, innocent people. No! You still prefer to hide from me? Very well. I think I'll leave you to your gift for today. But remember, this is not over. I'll be back for you. I will have you, one way or another. My parents! They're gone. Spare yourself some pain and walk the other way. Don't look back. I am going, Jin. And you can't stop me! As you wish. <sighs> it's all burning. I don't see any movement. I did warn you. Shut up! Hey, you! Careful. They don't look friendly. Looters. And they don't have a weapon. Then I guess it's up to me again. Is that your house? Yes. My parents. My brother. Maybe they went somewhere else? Don't patronize me! Uh, I have nowhere else to go. Maybe you could go to Shiba. We could survive in the city. Unless you want to lie down and die. I don't think your parents would have wanted that. Don't ever speak of them again. As you wish. Either way, you're still in danger here. Fire, looters... Even Marit could come back. Fine. Shiba. Helping me. You're right. I should stop. If you die, I go free. But you saved my life, and I suppose I'm responsible for all of this. Consider it my debt to you. Oh, thank you very much. That makes it all better. Let me be clear. I won't rest until I find a way to get you out of my body. Just Elgini Al Musab. It's not as dangerous as it looks. I doubt that very much. How did you know the name of that thing? Have you never seen one before? Not anywhere near my village. 
Ah, well. We're getting closer to the border. At the places where your world and mine meet, the two tend to bleed over into each other. Shiba is the closest human kingdom to the realm of the Jin. You'll find beings here that don't exist anywhere else. Your world is... It can be, but it can be wonderful as well.
Are you going to stay silent for the rest of this trip? Yes, and I'd prefer you silent too. <laughs> That's not going to happen. Like it or not, you're all I've got to talk to for the foreseeable future. <sighs> Can't you hear my thoughts? No. Well, if you could, you'd know my only interest in this world now is getting you out of me. And then what? Take below the revenge for what I did? You know, that's a good suggestion. Fine. When we get to Shiva, I'll help. Getting separated from you sounds wonderful. I'm glad we agree on something. Now be quiet. <laughs> Yeah. <sighs> 